we introduce a brand new series of Sigland oscilloscopes as the S2000. The series includes 8 models featuring 2 and 4 channels with a band width from 70 to 300 MHz. General characteristics Sampling rate 2 GSI per second Memory depth 28 MB Waveform acquisition rate 110,000 WFMS per second. You may also upgrade the functional characteristics of the oscilloscope using additional options. A single channel 25 MHz waveform generator, a data transfer protocol decoder, an 8 channel logic signal analyzer, and a power analysis module. Let's start our introduction with the top model of this series, Sigland SDS2304. As you may guess from the model name, it has 4 channels and a bandwidth 300 MHz. The front panel houses an H display with 800 by 480 pines resolution, the controls, a power button, input channel connectors, an optional logic signal analyzer connector, a USB flash drive connector, a calibration generator output, a waveform generator connector. The controls are divided into areas, horizontal system controls, sweep enabling disabling generator control, multifunction rotor switch synchronization control, Oscilloscope settings Decoder, logic analyzer, mass functions and reference waveforms control Vertical system controls It is very convenient that each channel has its own pair of rotary switches as well as functional buttons. The back panel houses the following connectors external synchronization output, pass fail output, LAN, and USB connectors. Here you may also find the Kensington lock, power input, and the cooler. The accessories are shipped in a carton. The package includes a CD with software and document, short guide. A set of four measuring probes, dual channel models have two probes, a USB cable, a power cable. To compare the dimension of the series to other similar devices, let's have a look at Sigland SDS2000 and the Sigland SDS1000. SDS2000 is more narrow and at the same time significantly higher. And a little bit wider. Let's proceed to the review. We switch on the oscilloscope. Then we connect the measuring probe to channel 1 and perform the probe capacity compensation using a calibration generator. Use an adjustment screwdriver from the package. Now the scope is ready for operation. The device is characterized by a high quality of manufacturing and excellent ergonomics as all Sigland oscilloscopes. Parameters control for each channel are intuitive and do not require learning. This also relates to changing the trigger level and parameters. Thirty-two auto measurement parameters are provided for monitoring the signal. As an example, we demonstrate measuring two of them: peak-to-peak -peak voltage, 
and frequency of the signal. You may see the measured values in real time on the display. Settings and waveforms may be stored and recalled from the memory. The basic functions and capabilities of Sigland SDS2000 are similar to those of the most of digital oscilloscopes. However, we should separately mention additional optional functions. 25 MHz waveform generator, serial protocol decoder, logic signal analyzer. You need a special module for its operation. It should be connected to a special connector on the front panel. To activate these functions, you should enter a 16-digit license number that is to be bought separately. Let's start demonstrate the process of waveform generator activation. Restart the oscilloscope. The pop-up window with information about additional functions appears on the screen at startup. We have activated the protocol decoder and generator function in trial mode. 27 operations left. For activation we enter utility menu, go to page 3 and press options. Select the option type, it is AWG in our case. Press license and enter the previously bought code. You select the symbol using a multifunction rotary switch. You may use delete button to delete the incorrect symbol if needed. If you enter the code and check its correctness, confirm the license key. In case of successful activation, the corresponding message is displayed. Restart the oscilloscope once again. You may see that the generator is activated. To check the license information, press Information in Options menu. Now we may explore the generator capabilities in detail. We connect it to the channel 1 of the scope. The default value is a sinus with 1 kHz frequency and peak-to-peak -peak voltage of 4 V. Maximum output frequency of a sinus signal is 25 MHz, and we set this value. There are other waveforms available. Square wave with maximum frequency of 10 MHz, but at such frequency at maximum of 25 MHz bandwidth, its form is distorted. However, it has a correct form at 1 MHz. RAM signal with a frequency up to 300 kHz. Pulse signal with a frequency up to 10 MHz. A direct component signal, we may set its offset. Noise. Cardiac signal up to 5 MHz. Ghost pulse up to 5 MHz. Rising exponential curve up to 5 MHz. Falling exponential curve up to 5 MHz. And 4 arbitrary signals. Let's briefly review the data transfer protocol decoder. Twelve C protocol SPI 
UARTRS232, CAN and LIN. H-Channel Logic Signal Analyzer For its operation, you should connect a special module to the front panel connector. One of the most significant advantages of SDS2000 model is SPO technology, which implies high acquisition rate and deep memory. Let's demonstrate this technology on a simple example. We apply a 1 kHz cardiac signal on the oscilloscope input. And save it to the memory as a reference 1. The current sweep is 50 microseconds per division. We increase the sweep to 5 seconds per division. As the display has 14 divisions, the signal fills the screen in 70 seconds. After the time passes, press Stop and expand the saved signal 100,000 times to a 50 microseconds per division. For comparison, we display the previously saved reference signal. As you may witness, the signals are equal. So the SPO technology allows storing the large amounts of information for further processing and analysis without signal distortion and loss. The example of the SDS2000 series testifies the rapid development of Siglent company. Now the manufacturer may compete with market leaders in the sphere of middle class oscilloscopes and at the same time offers wider possibilities for the user particularly a waveform generator, a protocol decoder, a logic analyzer, and more.